What are the seven areas of home economics? Number one, cooking. Cooking is an intel learning how to fulfill balanced, nutritious meals for themselves and others is a big step in encouraging students to be independent and take control of their health. Number two, child development. In this area, students are taught all of about child development and how to respond correctly to children at their various developmental stages. Number three, education and community awareness. During these classes, students would learn the best ways to teach the children basic maths and reading and reading skills before entering schools. Students would also learn moral and ethical lessons to develop community awareness. Number four, home management and design. Cleanliness and organization were a big focus of this area of home economics as these were tasks that were almost always the responsibility of the woman. Number five, sewing and textiles. Originally, it was a necessity for women to know how to sew so they could make and repair their own clothes. Number five, budget and economy. Learning how to efficiently handle money is a really useful part of home economics. Students learn how to buy food and other essentials on a budget, which is a skill that will serve in later life. Number seven, health and hygiene. In classes on health and hygiene, students learn how to prepare and preserve foods to prevent diseases. This area of home economics education also used to have a big focus on properly caring for sick people as it was essential that young women had an understanding of how to care for the sick people in their community.